if you want to share a picture of your decoder you actually basically take the rf out and you put it at the multiple switch you take your rf out you put on the multiple switch and then you can share it to many television on this case we got four-way multiple switch you can take from rf out of your decoder and share to this multiple switch and then you take it to four television meaning you can take it to four tv in your house but we got a problem you come out with hd decoder like this one who doesn't have an rf out how can you share your hd decoder who doesn't have an rf out to four television like this one stay tuned till the end of this video let's share let go and share the knowledge don't forget to subscribe to this channel channel of technician channel of entrepreneur channel of business people don't forget to share of technician welcome to the channel of entrepreneur welcome to the channel of business people before i explain the video how you can connect your hd decoder to for television i will advise you to go and watch to go and watch this video is a previous video which i actually make to show you how to connect your hd decoder to a second television so from that you're going to understand how to connect it now to for television so look at this presentation at the moment we got here a HD decoder and then I got here a modulator. So the combination of these two will give you a possibility of sharing your decoder to four television. So what happened? You should have your HD decoder. It can be your Explorer decoder. Remember, it can be a decoder who doesn't have an RF output. It doesn't have an RF output, but it got an AV app output. So we got an HD decoder, a small portable HD decoder like this one. So your decoder is actually connected like this. To a modulator so your decoder is connected to your tv and also to your a modulator and now as follow you got your quartial cable coming from the dish you got the power cable who's connecting your your modulator as you can see so you will be having your power supply your 12 volt power supply which is this one you have your 12 12 volt power supply you got your av cable who supply your modulator you got your power cable power cable who supply the power to your modulator and you got your coaxial cables who bring the signal from the lmb to your hd decoder now after you do this installation you combine to your decoder the modulator as it is you're gonna have a rf out rf out coaxial cable here and from this rf out radio frequency coaxial cable that's from where you're going to connect your four television so you can share from this four television or more on this single HD decoder. So that the point is that to share this signal, who's supposed to go to the second television to more than one television, you will need what we call multiple switch. So you have to get a multiple switch. You take the RF out here, you go to your multiple switch, and from the multiple switch, you can share to more than four television. You can see it's very easy to do so. So firstly, connect your HD decoder. Combine to your HD decoder a modulator like this one. The modulator needs a power supply, 5 volt power supply, which you connect to the USB of your decoder. The modulator needs the signal, AV signal, which go into your modulator and come out here on RF out. It come out here on RF out. And this is the signal you're going to share to many television okay and then to share to many television you need a multiple switch so what are you going to do right now we're going to put in the end here a multiple switch so this is how we're going to connect our uh, rf out to many television so we're going to use a four-way four-way multiple switch this is a multiple switch this one is a four-way it got an input and then it got four output so as you can see this is my input and the other four is the output. So if I use a four-way multiple switch, I will be able to connect this decoder to four television. If I use two-way multiple switch, I'll be able to connect it to two television. If I use six-way multiple switch, I'll be able to connect it to, to six television. So in another way, uh, you connect it to many television according to the switch you are using, to the multiple switch you are using. And I want you to pay in mind that don't make the cable from this multiple switch very long. 
to your television. If the cable is very long, you're going to lose the signal and then the signal will be poor. It will shower. So we don't want to have a long, long cable. I would advise you to limit your cable maximum of 15 meter so that you can have a good picture to the next television. Okay. So what we're going to do, we're going to use in this case, four way multiple switch. We're going to take the RF cable. We're going to put it in the end of our multiple switch. Gonna put it in in of our four-way multiple switch. We put it there, as we can see. We put it there. So what happened now is that from the HD decoder, from the AV, we take the signal, your picture and the sound from the AV cable. We take it here. To our modulator we power the modulator here and we come out from rf we go to the multiple switch and you can see the four-way multiple switch one two three four so if i connect now the cable here i can go to one room connect it here i go to another room connect here i go to another room connect here i go to another room so this one going to allow me it's going to allow me to share the signal of my hd decoder my small decoder sitting in my sitting room i'll be able to share it in the whole house with four television using four-way multiple switch guys if this video was good for you you know what to do don't forget to do yes give me this and subscribe subscribe because in this channel we only share and we grow together don't forget that we grow together in this channel Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching the channel of technician, channel of technician, channel of entrepreneur and channel of business people. My name is Alphonse Foucault. I hope I'm going to see you in my next video. Thank you and goodbye.